yo, yo, yo. Happy Friday, yo, yo. <laughs> How's it going? I almost, I almost forgot that I should be streaming. Let's move that one. Hey, to our mod Chilstranda. Hey, how you doing? I almost forgot that I should be streaming, so I have no coffee. Boo his. Hey, Amir. Very nice to see you, Captain Bows. Atski. Zealin Bruder Romanos Miller. Hey, JP Ek. Fantastic. You're returning. How's it going? How's it going? Who, have you ever, did you ever see the Arnold Schwarzenegger sound um, prank, soundboard prank? A very old, like many years ago on internet. Soundboards is like the audio clips from movies, etc. And they they prank call people using uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger's voice. So he has like canned responses and canned uh, questions and so on. And uh, in it is like from Kindergarten Cop, where it's uh, where it's like, who's your daddy and what does he do? And uh, it's hilarious. There's some really good ones. I, r I really need to re-listen to this. I, I just remembered it. Hey, Dearborn, how's it going? Quentin, yo, what's up? It's, uh, it's, it's a funny one. All right, so as you can see, um, another one, another design time. This time, I think I'll do a little bit like post-apocalyptic. Uh, let's touch the microphone a little bit more. <laughs> touch it. Fantastic sound. Uh, post-apocalyptic type thing. Another cheating lesson, yeah. This time it's some horrible canned 3D character. But whatever. It is for the sake of doing something. Time's a ticking. Let's get going. Let's start. So, this um, I'm going to be drawing is a... Uh, I was thinking I'm going to try to revive an old IP I had a long time ago. So what I want to do now is that I'm not going to do line art per se. I'm going to sketch, um, but kind of try to do line art, but sketch at the same time. So it's a little bit of a deviation of the, like the super clean line art stuff. Um, but I'm going to be sketching. <laughs> Compound sounds. Fantastic. Hey Brandon, how's it going? Hey, uh, Captain Bose, I have seen this ASMR written before, but I don't know what it means. What does it mean? Would you mind uh, telling me what ASMR means? I saw this weird streamer lady do ASMR streams. I have no idea what it means. Hey, <laughs> stinkies. Hey, Captain Jet. Like, how's it going? Stinkies. That's hilarious. Have you smelled yourself lately, Captain? Or you're busy driving the... Driving the boat. That is like such a kind of a juvenile choice of words. Stinky. Oh, you stink. <laughs> I'm good, Brandon. I'm good, man. ASMR is about sounds that trigger good feelings in some people, like tingling sensation. Hmm. It sounds a little bit like 
I guess sexual? Kept them both. Huh. Weird whisper and stuff. That's that's weird ASMR. I really need to look into what that ac actually actually means. It seems um odd. <laughs> Captain Jet like, yeah. Yeah. Sexual sounds. It's a little bit, yeah. It sounds like like some sort of inclination. <laughs> You're leaning towards something particular. Porn voices. <laughs> Autonomous sensory meridian response. Huh. Autonomous sensory meridian response is a pleasant physical or emotional feeling, not based on in science. Uh, triggered most often by s soft sounds such as vocal or fry, rustling leaves, crinkling paper, or scratching dry skin. I hate you hate me whispered in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Private space. That is funny. That is hilarious. Yeah, yeah, the scratching of a uh, pencil and paper is a lovely sound. <laughs> Private space. So you mean if I whispering? <laughs> uh, scratching dry skin is a pleasant sound. Nah, not for me though. Hey Mila, how's it going? Good morning. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. And uh, Andrea, if you're there, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. But I think you you are not around anymore. I want coffee. I forgot to make coffee. Hey, Bon88, how's it going? How's it going? <laughs> yeah, this is classic Friday topic. It's, uh... Yeah, ASMR. And, uh... Captain Jetlag's private ear space. <laughs> I'm fine, thank you, Bon. I'm all good. It's Friday. I'm uh, looking forward to the weekend. Is there, uh, like, ASMR videos on YouTube? When did the ASMR all of a sudden become something, like, on, on, on Twitch? Like, I see it constantly now. And people constantly referring to ASMR is it some sort of new catchphrase catch thing to do or to me it's a little bit like something a bo boob streamer would do like oh let's do some ASMR and she's like rubbing her hands together while pushing the cleavage together like oh yeah let's ASMR some Oh, is Bones the one with the private ears? <laughs> Yours are public domain. <laughs> but less bondage, you, that's hilarious. <laughs> uh. Oh man, I can't even begin to, to... My ears, even from a distance, can't take someone eating with their mouth open. That is for me just... Like, my skin want to roll off me and, and roll over to that person and slap them in the fa face so they shut their mouth. I can't take, I can't take loud eaters. Or like, chewing like, oh man, just thinking about it irks me. Ah. That is one of the things that 
that can literally drive me crazy. <laughs> Quentin, yeah, I know. Like, it even went so far that I couldn't eat breakfast with my, my family growing up. Like, they were sitting there chewing their chewing their toast and drinking their tea or whatever, and I would just sit there and go, like, this is torture! <laughs> well, the thing is, it's like, if it's just a moderate sound level, that's fine. But I guess my, my family, as a kid, were loud breakfast eaters. I couldn't take it. I just had to wait for them to eat, and then I could eat. And another another thing for, like, streamers, when they're sitting and eating while streaming, uh, is, is, is torture. It's such massive, massive torture. I can't take it. I mute them. I like look at the clock and mute them for five minutes and I hope they're finished eating when I unmute them. <laughs> it's horrible. Yeah. JP, definitely. But the thing is, is like there's a there's a certain there has to have a certain quality to it that makes me lose it. <laughs> I lose my cool. But if it's just you know like it, I'm completely okay with people making noises while eating, but there is a certain certain uh, quality to it that. That when I hear it, it's like, okay, that's that sound. That sound that you are making right now is breaking my mind. <laughs> Slurping. Well, the thing is, <laughs> I don't mind slurping. I, I, I hate that uh, sound afterwards. You know, like when it goes... <laughs> that, that makes me go crazy. Yeah, of course, Quentin. When they're doing it on purpose, it's no longer this this fine, uh, fine, uh, like subtlety to it. It's like a oh, fine whatever I can hear you make, making it up. That <laughs> little smack, yeah. <laughs> oh, God damn it! I'm getting triggered by just thinking about it. <coughs> Or loud kissing couples. I I think I think I'm fine with loud kissing, but v <laughs> I love this ch choice of words. But when it goes like when it becomes too like uh, too orifice sounding, you know, when it sounds like you have rubber boots and s boots and stepping in mud. That kind of back, what's it called? Is it back draft when you push the shoe up from the mud and it goes, you know, when the, there's a in, in vacuum in inside when there's a uh, uh, sealed air. <laughs> When they're kissing and you hear that sound, then you go like, oh, come on, time out, time out, or go somewhere else. <laughs> that is horrible. That makes me go crazy. <laughs> yeah, you're losing it in the office. <laughs> yeah, that's horrible, man. It's horrible.
and another sound that that makes me like want to go do something about it is when people have shit in their nose and you can really hear them breathing through the nose like usually it's like 50 year old men with really big eyebrows that go like and you can and you can like really hear them from across the room when they're they're like go blow your nose or 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 like wash it or something do something about that state you just can't sit there and loud breathe through your nose <laughs> that that makes me also fucking losing it Pro 42. Yeah, I don't know what this ASMR thing is. I'm just talking about annoying sounds at the moment. <laughs> I'm not really trying to have an ASMR. Well, it's apparently some sort of auditory sensory bullshit. Uh oh! <laughs> Quentin! That is the perfect explanation. Gargle sounds. <laughs> Yeah, like this, I I call it like the, there's a stuck potato in the back of your throat, the potato sound, like, just, <laughs> it's hilarious, that is hilarious. <laughs> yeah, young people who forget to clear their noses, yeah, but, but when it's kids, it's like, oh, bless you little thing, blow, here, blow. And they blow, and then it's like, ah, oh, okay. Order is restored. <laughs> Something stuck. <laughs> yeah. Quentin, that's 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 brilliant. Gargly noise. <laughs> Real drama. <laughs> yeah, man. I find like some certain words can also trigger that feeling. Hey, Jimmy the Brush, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Nice to see you here. We're talking about annoying, annoying noises that triggers us. And uh, <laughs> we we touched upon some brilliant, brilliant annoyances. Hilarious. I'm fine, thank you, Jimmy the Brush. How's the, how are you? Thanks, thanks. Moist. <laughs> yeah. Right, Captain Boss. Right, that's interesting. For me, I think the the opposite, like what's triggering, is is calming, and that's uh, wind for me, like rustles of leaves, and like being out in the forest. That's calming. Deadline. <laughs> <Nah>. <laughs> Yesterday. Little yappy dogs. Oh yeah, man. Let's see what Quentin clicked there. Oh, that one. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that and that picture goes really... <laughs> that, that's, that's like makes the, your, your spine tingle. Now we're moving on to words. <laughs> oh. 
Oh yeah, Captain Jetlag. For me, <clears throat> like one of those kind of soothing sounds that that are pleasant. Not, so let's not talk about the ones that triggers us. But um, it's uh, hearing, like hearing someone across the apartment or house when you wake up. So when you like you wake up, you don't open your eyes, but you hear them, like in a distance, uh, talk about something like you don't hear the, the conversation but you hear the conversation and you're just like lying in bed not moving and you're awake but you you don't want to wake up that sound of like someone just having a discussion like at the far end of the house like in a kitchen or something that is like that and and then the sensation of having sun hitting you from the window that is like bliss I kept the jet lag. <laughs> yeah. That's nice. Yeah, Zialin. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, having monotonous melody in your language is horrible. That that to me is like sleeping uh, medicine. Like you you just like I sit there with one eye open and like oh this is whatever you and you get warm and 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 you just feel like no I'm going to check out for a, for half an hour here this is not for me have a great weekend there bard and uh my best to your family and uh for a speedy recovery I will most likely stream over the weekend uh, working on a, a IP uh, or book cover Oh, for the you who uh, for I'm not I'm not doing any sketching today. It seems like I'm just talking. Uh, for for those who ca caught my um, book cover stream, here's uh, where the book cover is at the moment. Uh, I'm waiting for their response. Oh. Right, so <clears throat> if we switch this off, yeah, that's pretty good. More or less what I had in mind, but I still want to develop this a little bit more. So this uh, character is a part of a of a idea I had many years ago. I did my exam work uh, based on 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 this. Um, it was a really cool idea. I want to revive it, and I want to see if I can't um, get somewhere with it. I already have some early discussions with producers, but uh, I'm going to need to uh, get somewhere visually with it first. So that's that's what I'm going to try to do now. The, the for those who catched me when doing those kind of kid kid movie stuffs uh, paintings. I think those are gonna be on hold because they feel a little bit further away from being achievable. So I'm gonna switch to this old IP that I already have characters and story for and so on. So I'm gonna be uh, developing this on streams if I'm not gonna do that book cover. Zealin, yeah, rain is a very common, calming sense uh, sound. Yeah, I love that. Or, <coughs> or if you have children, uh, when you do have children, or if you have them, uh, and hearing the baby, uh, the baby sleep, is a super calming sound for to me. Like when they're li these little things and this, they just sleep there and this little short breathing and you just put your head next to them and, and fall asleep. Uh, Zealin, no, not the futuristic police. Uh, that was a game 
but uh, I have very very little time to produce a game and especially do 3D and 3D animations for it so we decided uh, to stop working on that game because I don't have time for it not to that extent uh, I mean a personal IP I can paint for where I don't need to do the painting then make a 3D model and then skin it and then texture it and it's just gonna it, it, it becomes too much of a time sink and I don't have time to fully chase that so we decided me and Thomas decided that maybe it's better to just can it and he took some of the assets and started doing a VR game with it but I just, I just can't do the 3D I don't have time for it fire yeah I have fireplaces in my house a couple of them and I uh, especially during winter I burn them uh, in the and it's such a nice sound The, what is called the smell of summer rain. I don't know if it has a specific name, but I love that smell of like hot asphalt with rain on it. The explanation of it on Wiki. All right, you gotta you gotta link it now. What's the explanation of it? Petricor? Stone, yeah. Petri. <laughs> that's pretty cool. That's cool, man. I think that's uh, something that lies in humans to love. Like, it's the smell of spring or smell of summer. Everything is alright when you, when, you when you smell that and then you know, like, alright things are correct now fluid that flows in the veins of gods <laughs> that is some serious epic stuff okay so <clears throat> probably should sketch some a little bit and not just talk about sounds <laughs> okay, I need to come up with some nice little details for this uh, outfit Oh, but I think uh, I think they're good enough as as is. Uh, I'll 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 block block in some col uh, col values. Value, 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 values. Captain Jetlag, yeah. It's a bit of a shame for people that have those experiences. My brother has a uh, hay hay fever. I guess it's called. Um, as soon as there's spring and everything starts blooming uh, his uh, eyes are just running constantly he can't he can't uh, enjoy it I find it interesting that I still managed to sketch something while <laughs> talking about so much uh, sounds and reading what everyone is writing. I must say I'm impressed that, <laughs> that I'm actually able to pat myself on the back a little bit. Captain Jet, like, yeah, the, like, facing the sun and smelling, uh, like, for me, one of the, the, what I loved is, like, a cold morning, 
but in the summer, right? And uh, you step out uh, of the door, and the first thing you are welcomed by when you step out of the door is uh, sunlight, really, really warm sunlight. That kind of sunlight that uh, you can feel through a window, you know, this like hugging warmth that just envelopes you. And, uh, and then when you breathe in, you get that super fresh air. I love that. I love that. That's, that's one of my favorite moments. And I think it's innate to love it. You know, it's it's been such a big thing of in of you in humans through through time that I think it's programmed in us by now to enjoy those moments. I sure love them. Bacon cooking in a pan. Now nah, that's for me. For me, the sound itself is not nice. The smell is not nice. I like the bacon afterwards when everything is done and you eat it. But you probably have some some sort of association with it. Oh, scratching my back. And uh, that it 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 like triggers you somehow. Right, that you you you, you th maybe think about breakfast or your mother or you know, but I'm not saying it's it's wrong or anything. I'm just saying, not for me. Just bake it. <laughs> Chocolatine, a hey, book a lemon. Oh, tar from tree stumps, yeah. Yeah, tar in general, I think, is a lovely smell. This kind of deep, deep smell. And tar um, in conjunction with uh, roof tiles and summer. You know, those rough, uh, hot roof tiles that you, c you can feel the heat from them e and em emanating from the uh, tar roof tiles. Oh uh, yeah, welcome. Just at the end of the stream. So today I sketched um, at another design, and it's an idea of an old, old character for an IP I had um, that I I'm gonna try to revive on my uh, weekend streams and night st nightly streams. I will talk about the IP to some extent um, but for now I'm gonna work obviously it's working time time all right thanks everyone for joining in it was a fantastic ASMR stream I guess I guess I did my first ASMR stream I feel a little bit dirty Yes, a good breakfast. Do have a listen. It was hilarious. Uh, he's go going straight up after the stream. No worries, Buka. It's always a pleasure. Thank you very much, JP. Uh, it was a little bit of a weird one this morning, but uh, hopefully, hopefully you guys don't mind. Um, and I also uh, I had a blast. And let's see if we don't have anyone we can host. So it's only one guy streaming, and he's doing this. This mask guy is doing some pretty cool. I think it looks like drooping skull. Uh, so let's host him, or raid him rather. Um,
so l again, um, I might be uh, streaming the weekend, so keep an eye out on my social media things or Discord. Um, anyways, thank you everyone, every single one of you for uh, joining in. It was a blast. Have a great one. Let's raid. And uh, see you to Monday morning or on the weekend. Bye! <laughs>